Hey you guys, welcome back to Mayfield Ranch. Katie and Gary here. So we thought we would share with you what's going on out here on our farm. We had a little bit of a break in this last weekend. The cattle from next door broke through the fence and were on our property. So not such a big deal. Luckily for us, our donkeys were up front in the front field. So Gary just checked the fence line here to see if we could see where the break was. This is actually brand new fencing from this spring. So it turns out like right at the corner, the cattle had knocked through the metal fencing just it had come loose from the post so they got in we actually didn't mind so much that they were here except they were trying to get to the cattle that's actually our next door neighbor's cattle and they were knocking down the other fence so we didn't want for that to happen so we were trying to get a hold of the neighbors that actually own the cattle they were out of town so we just really were first trying to get the cattle off of this fence so that that could stay intact. So you can see we had a little bit of a challenging time doing that. Some of them were fine going away to the other side just eating the grass. Um, we had one pesky little guy though who was super interested in getting over the fence next door. And our next door neighbor's bull, he's a really big bull but he's a really nice guy. He was pretty interested in getting over here. so. Luckily, he came out and fed his cows and tried to help us get his cows away from the fence so that we could get everybody back home where they needed to be. Go home, buddy. Go home. So this started out really friendly, but then this little guy decided to charge at me a couple times. Luckily, he's not mean at all. He was just scared, so he dropped his head and came after me. Don't run in my way. So I didn't get good video. I was holding on to the post so he couldn't knock me over. But I decided to stand back a little bit. and run him that way. Because they're knocking this whole thing down. We actually would have let the cattle just graze the back field until the neighbors got home if it wasn't for the fact they were trying to knock this other fence down. And we sure can't afford to have that one down too. So we just wanted to try to get them off this fence and get them back home safely. No, don't hit me. No. Yeah. about an hour or 
so we got a little help. Um, one of the neighbor's family members was finally able to come over and help get them back on their property. And then of course our other neighbor came out and got their cattle's attention with some hay.